So do ducks and geese really need swimming water to stay healthy? Well, no they don't. They just need enough water to cover up to the top of their bills when they drink so they can wash their mouth and nose. Now they don't need it, but they sure do like swimming water. You know, I like laying on the beach in Costa Rica. So today, we're gonna give Donald, the hardworking guard goose, a vacation in Costa Rica. Well, not really. Hey Donald, how's it going buddy? Donald, where are you going? So what is a guard goose? A guard goose is a goose you keep with your chickens or ducks to help keep small predators away from them. Now how could a goose keep predators away? I'll tell you, the answer is in one word, attitude. Geese have a lot of attitude. When a predator comes after a chicken, chickens just run. They freak out and they run. At nighttime, chickens will sit quietly while a raccoon or a possum comes through in the dark and kills them all. A goose, however, will not sit quietly. A goose will turn and face an attacker. Geese hiss. Geese will bite. They also, possibly most importantly, make a really, really loud noise. So if a goose isn't able to fend off or ward off an attacking predator, at least the goose can alert you and tell you something's going on. You need to get out there and check the chickens. If it was just the chickens, you probably wouldn't hear anything. The goose, though, will raise the alarm. Another thing that Donald the goose does is he keeps peace between all the roosters. Roosters fight a lot, but as soon as our roosters start attacking each other, Donald will hit the offender. He will hit them hard one time and it's over. The roosters separate, they go their own ways. I don't know why he does this. I think he knows that he's in charge and he doesn't like disorder and chaos. So he settles these conflicts very quickly and our roosters really don't fight. So through all of his hard work, Donald has won a trip to paradise. And he gets to bring two friends of his choice. We already know who he's gonna choose. It's gonna be the ducks. So we're taking Donald and the ducks to the place of their dreams. Yeah, we both got it. All right, bud, you hang out there, eat some grass, we'll get the ducks. Let's get the ducks. <laughs> okay, so we got the ducks out too. They don't like getting caught, but they're gonna like what we're doing. So let's just go slow and herd him down, Gracie, okay? I know you don't want to leave your job, Donald, but let's go down there, come on. My daddy's catching Donald. <laughs> Isn't funny? So Donald and the ducks did not want to be herded to the creek. They wanted to stick with their own kind. I'm a little afraid he's gonna peck me in the face. He's generally a really nice duck, uh, goose, but you just never know. What do you think, Donald? Here we are. We're at the creek. I'm gonna put you down here. I'm gonna put you down. All right, bud. Can I get some time? Yay! Yeah. Are they swimming? I hope. How about we put them in the baby? Yeah. No. Donald, everything's okay. Just relax and have a good time. So the ducks are having a great time, but Donald wants to be back at work. He's leaving the creek. He's looking for the chickens. They don't really want to be out here. They want to be in with the chickens. So they're just trying to figure out how to get back now. So we're going to help them. We're going to herd them back towards the chickens. So here's Donald and the ducks. And the chickens are right over there. All right, so Grace is herding them down the creek. We're gonna try to get them to cross over. 
Good job, Gracie. All right, good. Donald's headed up the bank. Hopefully the ducks will follow. Follow Donald, go up the hill. Grace, you got many. All right, now we just gotta get him to go up to the left. Up this bank. As soon as they see the chickens, they're gonna head right back over there. All right, as soon as he gets up that hill, he's gonna see the chickens. There they are, Donald. There's your chickens. I'm home, I'm home, I'm home. Homecoming of Donald. So glad to be back from vacation. Alrighty. Let's let him in. Yay! Alrighty, home again, home again. Go! There you go, Donald. He's like, what was all that about? It's neat to see this goose has really bonded with these chickens. And that's what's supposed to happen when you have a guard goose. If you have two geese and you keep them with chickens, they can just bond with each other and never really connect with the chickens. But when you have one goose and raise it with chickens, the goose actually thinks the chickens are its own kind and it will protect them. And that's the whole point. So in the end, it turns out that Donald and the ducks would rather have this little pail of water and hang out with their friends than play in the creek. The reason that we don't give the ducks water in here is because if the chickens were to fall in the swimming pool on a cold winter day, the chickens would not do well that night. It's time to shut up the chicken's pen tonight. And I'll show you what Donald does with the night intruders. That's actually the quietest he's ever been shutting them in at night. Usually he just screams. Hope you all enjoyed today's episode. And we will be back tomorrow. That was another great day on the homestead.